ready the sixth international yoga day comes in this pandemic situation to waken up everyone to fight against coronavirus disease covid 19 yoga helps to enhance one's immunity and keep oneself healthy morarji desai national institute of yoga is the national institution fully funded by ministry of ayush government of india morarji desai national institute of yoga is a focal institute for planning training promotion and coordination of yoga education training therapy and research in all its aspects morarji desai National Institute of Yoga aims to promote deeper understanding of yoga philosophy and practices based on classical yoga amongst people. The main vision and mission of the institute is health, harmony and happiness for all through yoga. The Moraji Desai National Institute of Yoga is also active in India's fight against coronavirus disease, COVID-19, along with Ministry of Ayush, Government of India. The Morarji Desai National Institute of Yoga has taken several initiatives like research in collaboration with the prestigious organizations and hospitals like Lady Hardinge Medical College, all India Institute of Medical Sciences, National Institute of Immunology, Delhi. Also, there are various yogic training programs like COVID Warriors Training, Stay Home, Stay Fit with Practice Yoga at Home, Yoga at Home for Active, Fitter and Healthier, You and Practice Yoga at Home, Actively Running Online on Digitalized Platform by Morarji Desai National Institute of Yoga. The Morarji Desai National Institute of Yoga is addressing COVID-19 pandemic problem through clinical studies for yoga with studying the impact of yoga interventions on people exposed to COVID-19 patients and yoga for rehabilitation of people recovered from COVID-19. The Morarji Desai National Institute of Yoga has set up an interdisciplinary research and development task force with a group of experts to formulate and develop strategies for this initiative. In this current pandemic situation, people are more in stress and fear which is actually deteriorating their immune system. Yoga is a discipline based on an extremely subtle science which focuses on bringing harmony between mind and body. Yoga helps to build up psycho-physiological health, pranic balance and emotional harmony and manage daily stress and its consequences. Yoga is particularly useful in conditions where stress is believed to play a role. Various yogic practices such as yoga sanas, pranayama, dhyana, cleansing and relaxation practices etc. are known help modulate the physiological response to stressors. Several randomized controlled studies have shown the efficacy of yogic practices in management of non-communicable diseases like hypertension, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, bronchial asthma, diabetes, sleep disorders, depression, obesity, etc. that can be comorbid conditions in patients with COVID-19. Yoga has also been shown to be useful in vulnerable populations such as elderly children. The function of the immune system is critical in the human response to infectious disease. A growing body of evidence identifies stress as a cofactor in infectious disease susceptibility and outcomes. Yoga has a significant role in the 
psychosocial care and rehabilitation of COVID-19 patients in quarantine and isolation. They are particularly useful in allaying their fears and anxiety, management of stress and anxiety, depression, improving immunity and psychosocial rehabilitation is also warranted in this current scenario of COVID-19. Yoga based lifestyle modules which can be used for different sections of the society in the present scenario are presented with the following objectives to improve immunity against infections in general among the population, to reduce susceptibility to infections in vulnerable populations, children, elderly and those with comorbid conditions such as diabetes and hypertension and those patients in isolation quarantine with or without mild symptoms. Ministry of Ayush, Government of India has also released advisory vetted from yoga experts. Advisory provides guidelines for yoga professionals, certified yoga professionals, teachers, instructors and therapists etc. to teach a safe set of yoga practices based on available scientific evidences to novices in all walks of society as a service to humanity during this pandemic of COVID-19. Following are the general guidelines and precautions for yoga practices. Practice sessions should start with a prayer. It should be performed slowly in a relaxed manner with awareness of the body and breath. Breathing should be always through the nostrils unless instructed. Yoga session should end with meditation, deep silence, sankalpa, etc.